They look like any other part-time football team, changing outside after a hard day at work. The players wear a variety of different training kit, but this is not a village kickabout. This is the Mauritius national team. The most problem is that uh, we all work. Yeah, we all work and uh, most of us uh, are in construction. Uh, it's not easy sometimes. Many of us don't take an, even a breakfast. We have to go to work and then uh, afterwards come uh, for training. It's, uh, it's a pleasure. It's a pleasure. We, we know it's uh, difficult for us, but uh, we like football. We love football. The Mauritius FA enjoyed a makeover ahead of the FIFA Congress. The new artificial pitch is as good as anything you will see, but with no floodlights. This is where the team actually train. Mauritius did not compete for a place in the World Cup because they could not afford to travel. It's a similar story for the Africa Cup of Nations. They're just not getting any game time. Probably in the near future, I have a very good national team. They are very young, they are talented, but the only thing that we, we, we are missing right now, no uh, international exposure. This is that we lack a lot of international exposure. And when we play uh, big teams in Africa, this is what um, uh, our main disadvantage to, against the, the players. But there is hope for the future. A grassroots development program hopes to broaden the talent base. But that won't be much help for the current team. It will be not for tomorrow. Huh? It will be many 10, 15 years. Because they are starting from uh, school now. And it's a good thing, you know. They are trying to introduce the professional league here. It will take time, but hopefully in, in the near future we'll, we'll have professional players like many countries in Africa. Mauritius do at least have some competitive football to look forward to. They take part in the Kasafa Cup in Zambia in July. And although some of the bigger nations view that tournament as a hindrance, for Mauritius it's vital. If we take the first game well, and we, we, we look forward to go through. But the first game is my worry because we don't play. We have not played any international games since December and I don't know how the player will react. If nothing else, at least the players will taste international football again. Now they just need to get the time off work. Dan Williams, CCTV News in Port Louis, Mauritius.